Hi guys, welcome to this um, real metal machine. This is CHA DWM and it's created with the knowledge of the Ariser.eu. Maybe we should go there. So Ariser is one of our projects for people who want to stay as close as possible to here he is, .eu, as close as possible to Arch. So Arclex is using all the Arch Linux packages and repositories, plus the packages from AWAR, plus the configurations of Arclex. Here we're using the pure Arch Linux ISO with a folder and scripts from Pico, or Pico Dev, or right, check out his GitHub. And the idea is to stay as close as possible to Arch Linux, but get there in the end, meaning you want to have something nice, beautiful, graphical, and all that, not a black thing to put into. So in these articles, and not that many articles, you make your own ISO, your own decisions, your own GitHubs, build the ISO, and you're there, you're golden for the next 20 years, as long as Arch Linux exists, of course. So what I've done, this um, Christmas 2022, I've developed my own personal ISO, simple. It's um, an anagram for a riser. If you change the words around, it's Sierra. So Sierra is just for me, right? I can build it, it's on the GitHub, you can check it out. But basically, I want to have an XFCE. XFCE, I want to have CHDWM as my basis. This machine I'm talking on is NVIDIA based. So yes, I have um, asked the guy, let's do it like this, Super D. NVIDIA is running and it's a normal NVIDIA, right? I have a laptop next to me here who has an NVIDIA driver, a 390 and an NV control to tell, hey, use NVIDIA. So it's all working. And I was thinking, I, I wanted to check if we made an article for it, well, we can actually stay here and then here. So YouTube and Arclex provides you all the knowledge you need for any Arch Linux based system because it's all Arch in the end. Let's wait for all that and the pop up. Okay. Still, we want to go still. And then finally, and I thought, let's search for NVIDIA modules. I thought I would get something and I do get something this time around, but not really what I wanted. Although here it is, early loading ATC make in its CPO. So this is has been created one year ago. And I think that contains exactly what I'm gonna show you right now. So the early loading, you can, so first of all, Wiki, Nvidia, only the guys who have Nvidia, check this out, otherwise eh, not interesting to read. But here it is, early loading for basic functionality, just adding the kernel parameter should suffice. You want to ensure it is loaded at the earliest possible location. Many times it's not needed, I have not done it on, on many of my setups. But here, it's a riser. Here, it's Alice Pico Dev, so some, somebody totally different who made the script. So if we go to this one, you'll see this is not me. Pico.dev made a lot of scripts to use all the Lego blocks that are coming from Arch. And then later on with an Arclix Nemesis script, we use the Lego blocks coming from Arclix. And we have a system that you're looking at right now. So with all the knowledge of all these people, we add something to something. And basically, PickleDev has done that. So we don't need to do anything. We just go to the computer file system and look at the result. Make initcpio.conf. Right, enter. We go to Perl, right? Set it the correct way. And th this way you see here the colors control set. So this one, NVIDIA. NVIDIA mode set, NVIDIA UVM, NVIDIA DRM. So that has been added. Normally it's just 
like this, right? So control Z, save. Sublime Text lets you save that there. You add this here. Well, a riser does it automatically, so no problem there. But this is exactly straight from the wiki. Is it needed? Not for me, but maybe for you. It, it all depends on the hardware, as simple as that. So that's what I wanted to share again, the modules. Now, if you do this and it was empty and you, you're running this while well, you're typing this, you need to run it afterwards as well. So I need to go to open a terminal and say sudo make initcpio minus capital P Linux or Linux LTS or anything that's available. No, you can't use the tab. You need to type it. And there you go. So Linux LTS or Xen motor and a preset. And the preset you see where it is in the make initcpio.d. So make initcpio.d in here. Use the one that exists, of course. Voila, that's it for me. We have an extra video about these modules of NVIDIA. All the knowledge is here. I'm not a specialist in NVIDIA not really and not in gaming either because it's often people who want to learn about how to game here it is right read and check it out because it's all bits and pieces and then you need to find and that's really it is really like that you need to find the sweet spot on your machine on every single machine you want to game right you need to find the sweet spot this there did that and it depends on the games you're play, gonna play as well we this morning I've built a proton, so yay proton, extra proton, which is now here he is. Where is he? There he is. Proton GE custom bin. So number forty-seven on the AUR is still forty-five. So I just saw that there was an update by I, I think it was Twitter or something, and I said okay, let's pull it in and let's see if it's already there it's not on the AUR yet but we have it already and you of course and you can build it as well on your own by changing the package build from this one but we've done it for you this morning so this is also a very important uh, file proton GE custom bin and maybe let's include that as well so github and proton proton or what was it GE something with it egg roll there he is <laughs> the glorious egg roll proton ge custom but here my knowledge ends right this is something to to do with gaming and that that's what that's where it ends and all kind of fixes for all kind of games i've never heard about but here it is and of course you can ask for things in here or somewhere else of course but i'm not a gamer so don't ask me i provide the package for you all right, the topic of the video is still the same. This one models just a little bit in the, the, the little bit of um, information there on the wiki of the Arch Linux wiki. Adding it here, rebuilding it, it's here. So make any CPO minus P Linux or Linux LTS, Linux Hard, Linux Hand, Linux Amod, etc. All right, cheers.